plaintiff, Conuetta Wright, says the defendant is her mother's cousin. And after her mother and father divorced, the defendant started dating her father. Conuet is suing because she claims the defendant used her father's credit card without authorization. Defendant Penia Anderson says the only reason Conuetta is suing her is because she thinks Penia is a gold digger who used her father for money. Penia insists she had permission to use the credit card and therefore doesn't owe Conuetta anything. Start with you. This is my cousin through my mother. She began dating my father a few years after their divorce. Your mother is her cousin. My mother is her cousin. This and is she after. began dating your mother's husband. Yes. After they were divorced? After they were divorced. Okay. It's actually after his second divorce. Okay. Um, they began dating. Mm -hmm. My father was renting the lower level of the family flat that she lives in and she owns. So he was paying her rent. He was, and they were dating. And during this time, um, I would go over and visit my father and things of that nature. And then Miss Anderson wanted me to notify her when I was coming over. So she was driving a wedge between me and my father, so to speak. So she wanted me to notify her when I was coming over. She claimed it was just to see me. But to me, she was monitoring our conversations. How old is he? My father's 65 years old. All right. And what was going on when you go by there? Oh, I would go by and check on him. Mm -hmm. Everything was fine? Yeah, with he and his uh, uh, mate? No, well, she lived upstairs. I was visiting my dad. Okay, so they they weren't dating. They were dating, but, but they lived up in and, separate dwellings. All right, they yes. just sneak up and down. Now you didn't have to sneak. They just go up and down. There's the back stairs. Okay, <laughs> that's where his women come in and she didn't know about. <laughs> <laughs> go ahead. How long were they together? Uh, have they been if they're still together? No, they're not. Okay, how long were they together to your knowledge? Maybe five, six years. What happened? What caused them to break up to your knowledge? I told my father he had to come and live with me because he's ill. Okay, and why wouldn't she care for him? You don't know? Because she was not, and he missed, he missed doctor's appointments. Okay. He had medication that I had to throw out that was old and outdated that he was not taking. Okay. Um, there was no food in the refrigerator. Let me get some background from you. And my cousin is bringing me here to sue me because she thinks I'm a gold digger and a user. We and I were just friends. And one day he made a proposal to me that he wanted us to be more than friends. And I, I said, why should I keep putting everybody else's feelings before mine? Why can't I have somebody that's like me, that's sweet, that's kind, and he makes me laugh, somebody that I love? I knew it was going to be an issue because the family. Mm -hmm. I never, ever tried to get in between her and her father. So let me ask you this. You've known each other since when? All of her life? How long? She was the child that uh, was in my house. Okay. Little girl, beautiful little girl. That I... And you all got along yes. for all that yes. time. all that Up time. until the time you start dating her father. father. Mm -hmm. That's not true. Why did you all stop getting along and when? 2014. I addressed some issues with her. Why? Why was yes. because of no food in the refrigerator. I have okay, and she was caring for him. That's and she that was, was the reason. Ma'am, uh, did she ever complain to you about food and all those things she mentioned? In 2014 mm -hmm. or 13, we had a discussion about me and her father and what our relationship was. Okay, no, did she complain about your caretaking for her father? Yes, and I, I told her, I okay. cook, and I have a refrigerator upstairs, mm -hmm. and we had one downstairs. So, like we started off, William and I started off, I would cook upstairs. And bring it down. And mm -hmm. bring it down. So, we initially, he had access to both houses. And so either I'd bring stuff up or bring stuff down to both places. But the point I was trying to establish... She uh, did mention that to me, and I 
told her well, this you, exact thing. You gave me the impression or stated that the primary reason that you all's relationship broke down was because you began dating her dad. Then she says, no, it broke down because you were not caring for her dad in a manner that she expected and hoped would uh, provide for his good health. And you now admit that that conversation occurred as well. So there was a legitimate concern from her. Okay. Let me get to her. Give me your uh, reason for suing. June of 2018, mm -hmm. I was at, um, I got power of attorney of my father for his health and, and um, financial. And I found a statement where it had all these charges. So I went back and started looking. I pulled up his account. And there was a lot, a number of charges where overdraft fees were occurred, um, video games, things of that nature. What years? It started in 2015, all the way up to June of 2018. Okay, from 15 to 18, you observed spending that you don't think your father will have approved of? Is that what you're saying? Yes, sir. All right, and how do you know he would not have approved of it? because I talked to him about it. He didn't know mm -hmm. they had occurred. He was able to recall all the charges from 2015 to 2018? He didn't have his debit card. Miss okay. Anderson had. He could recall whether he approved it or not? Yes, we talked to him. Okay, so every, husband. hold on, every charge. Not that every was, charge. That's what we're talking about. That's, that's he has to be able to know what charges were legitimate or not. And in order to do that, he has to look at all of them. I have. I don't want to see that yet. I want you to make sense okay. with me yes, or sir. make no sense. Yes. Yes, Your Honor. <laughs> and so far, that's where we're at. No sense. Yes, Your Honor. And so let's start this again. Yes, Your Honor. You said. She made unauthorized charges from 2015 to 2018. You discovered that in 18. Yes, right? Your Honor. And that's when you went back. Dad, which ones did you authorize and which ones did you not? Yes, Your Honor. And then he told you, he looked at it and told you which ones? Yes, Your Honor. Every charge and what they were for and whether they were authorized for three whole years. Yes, you're right. Okay, he's better than me and most folks I know. <laughs> All right, you had me something for three years, I wouldn't know whether I authorized it or not. Okay, and he told you the amount that was not authorized and it equaled what? Let's see, you're, now I can look at your charges that you're referring to that he authorized or did not. And how much did it come to? $5,261.24. All right, 5, 000. And when you mentioned it to uh, Ms. Anderson, what did she say? She said that he knew about it and she gave him money back for some of them. Okay, ma'am? Yes, I did tell her, like, if I borrowed money from him, I would give it back. But William authorized uh, transactions for food transactions to go get stuff for the house. He had my car fixed because I was driving him back and forth to the doctor before she came in. No, you were Yes, not. I was. The, with the gray car, I had that you car. You are from Detroit, it appears? Yes. yes. Well, you love that rib joint, didn't you? Yes. <laughs> Well, I'm just saying, man. I see, quite, I see quite a few baby bag ribs on here. <laughs> all right, all right. Burger and, King. And, Your Honor. Yes. I would like to clarify for Miss Anderson that I have where you missed several appointments. He missed his appointments because of you. Oh, He's he in the situation. Hold on. Because, man, you talked. You were supposed to take him to the doctor because I was doing it first. You offered oh. to help. Yes. No, that's not how I, it was. Yes, it was. What did you borrow? You just said you borrowed I, sometimes and you repaid it. Tell yes. me some numbers. It was $260 I borrowed to uh, get the car repaired. Uh-huh. There... Paid it back? Yep. Mm -hmm. And let's see. So Early, I think, like, an oil change. Okay. Doesn't sound like it was anything significant. No. Uh, for any significant reason. Yes, ma'am. Your Honor. Mm-hmm. When we discussed this at my house about mm -hmm. the money that you said you gave back mm -hmm. in front of my father, yes. he said that you did not give him any money back. He All right. Said, he said he did not know. 
All right. That that's is what he not said. what he said. Yes, he did. He told he dropped me his head. right in front of you that he, he did said not he did not know. Any money from and you, you said, are you man, just saying so this because quiet, she's man, here? Quiet. It, it, it's so difficult for me to believe <laughs> that a a 65 year old man can go through 25 pages of charges over three years and can look and determine each charge. Let me, it's 25 pages. Let me tell you how many it would be. 1, 2, 3, 4, 10, 20, 30, 40, 50, 60, 70, 80. About 90 per page. Your Honor. Multiply, no, multiply that time 25 pages. 2,250. He can remember 2,250 charges when he looks at them and say, oh, I authorized that. Your Honor. That, that's the 2,213th. No, I didn't authorize that 2,213th, mm. but I authorized the 2,214th for sure. <laughs> <laughs> Don't believe it. Yes, ma'am. Your Honor, mm -hmm. I am going to say this. My father did not have his debit card. He was not in possession of it. Okay. She was. All right. She knew when he got sick in 2016 mm -hmm. where I talked to her and told her what about What you have to condition. do today is prove the amount of unauthorized charges that you're suing for. My daddy doesn't have a car. So there are some things on there where she purchased things. Ma'am, this is 25 pages. Under no circumstances am I going to go through it, <laughs> and I don't believe your father has gone through every charge and determined which one he authorized over the course of three years. I have to dismiss your claim. Have a good day. She has never agreed with me and her father being together in the No, first that's place. not, that was yes, my mother. Yes, it is. And yes, you know that's is. my mother. I never even cared. Come on now. I never even cared until my father got sick. You was wrong. I slept with your dad. I was like his wife. So you were not like his wife. No, I don't. You wasn't there all the time. Pim. Who wasn't? And you no, know it. No, you weren't. That's the you, whole problem. No, it wasn't you that were I wasn't there. there. I take my daddy to the doctor. Yeah, now I, you do. No, after I'm I lost my car, don't, you do. Don't, no, no. Hey, you're. Hey, After I lost my car. What you mean?